There's an amazing woman in our audience right now who opened a school to help kids on the south side of Chicago. Uh, where is Valerie Grove? <laughs> Valerie, come on down. I want to talk to you. Come here. What's up? How you doing? Hi. Welcome. So happy to meet you. Absolutely. I'm, Surprise. I love you. I, I think you're great. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Surprise. Now, you thought you were just here to enjoy the show. Were you having a good time? Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Now, listen, we, we, we're, you're here because of the incredible things that you're doing. Please tell us the name of your school and the grades that you serve. Sure. Our school is Ryan Banks Academy, and we are seventh grade through 10th grade mm -hmm. in Chicago. That's amazing. Now, I understand that you were also a social worker before you opened it, so please give us a little bit of the origin behind this. Yeah, I worked as a school social worker in Chicago, and one of my students was named Ryan, and unfortunately he was shot and killed. He was 12 years old um, wow. in front of his house one day back in 2012, um, so I was inspired to start a school named in his honor. Absolutely, and I know that the school does more than just educate your students, right? Explain what you do. Yeah, a lot more than just school. Um, we really try to focus on the whole child. A lot of that is mental health support and social emotional learning. Mm -hmm. um, Chicago, there's a lot going on. A lot of students, unfortunately, are mm -hmm. facing homelessness, um, poverty, not having food on the table. Um, violence is a real serious issue mm -hmm. in our city. Mm -hmm. And so trying to really give the kids kind of that holistic wraparound that they need um, and help them to love school again. A lot of them kind of have scholastic trauma from Absolutely. just not getting the right resources before. So of trying course. to kind of give them that confidence back. And especially when in a place where they have to say they, they literally have to spend you know all day every day you want to make sure that they have that experience and I understand that you know you also help students outside of the school as well sometimes even going out of your pocket and then sometimes taking students in when they had nowhere else to go right yeah, well, we try to do whatever we can, and sometimes that's the school, and sometimes it's a lot more than that, whether it's getting them to a doctor appointment or helping to bring them in if they need a safe home, kind of in between homes. Mm -hmm. um, during COVID, we did a lot for our students and brought them groceries, and our staff brought birthday cakes to our kids mm -hmm. on their birthdays so they didn't feel alone. Now, that's a, yeah, yeah, that, I mean, and I understand that you've also, you've also gone through a lot, like, fighting to keep the doors open, so please tell us what you've done and why is it important to keep the fight alive? It was a crazy journey to get here for sure. Um, a lot of people worked really hard. Um, lots of amazing people on our team and our staff. And um, it was a hard journey for me, I think, just trying to not know what's going to happen is it possible and, you know, um, putting a lot of things on the line mm -hmm. to get here. But our, our, our doors are open and we've got amazing kids. So it's I all worthwhile. It. I love it. And, and, you, and you can kind of feel. You can feel that love for her students, right? I know you love your students. Um, yeah. I have a surprise for you. Kids, are you, kids, are you there? Hey. Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> What's up, everybody? Thank y'all so much for helping me surprise Val. Oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs> um, Charlene, are you there? Oh my God. <laughs> hey. Hey, oh hey. My God. hey. Uh, Charlene, what do you have to say about Val? Something I would like to say about Miss Valerie is that she's a very positive, a very hardworking woman, and I'm so glad that she made Ryan Banks Academy for students like me. Love it. Absolutely. <laughs> and then what about Destiny? Destiny, are you there? Hi. Hi. What's up, Destiny? And what did you have to say? Miss Valerie, you're selfless and strong. And I'm so grateful that you created RBA. Otherwise, I wouldn't have as many opportunities as I do today. Oh, it's so good to see you guys. Oh, my I God. Love I absolutely <laughs> love it. Now, listen, I mean, how are you, how are you feeling like seeing all this? This is really like a full circle moment right now, especially yeah. off of the seed of just a, a, a good notion and a good intention that you put out. Yeah, and there were so many days and years where I didn't know if it was going to happen. Right. Right. Oh my Absolutely. gosh, they're so great. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> now listen, we have to take a break, but when we come back, we have one more surprise for you. We'll be right back. All right, we're back with Valerie Growth and her students from Ryan Banks Academy in Chicago. Now, I, I know you have amazing programs that include art classes. Now, please explain why art is so important to your students. 
Art is so important to my students because they're so talented, they're so great at everything that they produce, especially in art. Um, but also art is a great way of expressing yourself. I think mm -hmm. for a lot of people, if they're not one, you talk about what they've gone through, art can be really therapeutic. Absolutely. Now listen, I understand that, uh, that funding is limited and uh, a lot of times you can't afford a lot of the art supplies. Uh, so we want to help with that. All right, uh, Arteza is a leading art supply company offering premium and affordable art supplies and crafts. They're dedicated to inspiring uh, others through art and want to give each of your students a large art set. Check this out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> now, they also want to give your school $10,000. Now, if you also want to find out how you can help with Ryan Banks Academy, go to our website and find out how you can help. I want to thank Nicole Byer. I want to thank my friend Ellen for asking me to host again. And I want to thank all of y'all for watching. Y'all have a great weekend, everybody. Yeah.